Rob Zombie is one of the most eccentric artists out there, and you may wonder where a man with that last name calls home. While his current residence is a stunning mansion in Los Angeles, it still gives off a dark, spooky atmosphere, just as you'd expect. Zombie and his wife, Sherry Moon Zombie, have reportedly poured over $7 million into crafting their shadowy, tree-covered compound nestled in the Hollywood Hills. We'll be taking a look at the place Rob Zombie calls home, including his past residences and even his Connecticut farm property. Rob Zombie and Sherry Moon Zombie are one of Hollywood's most dynamic and unique couples. Rob Zombie is a legendary musician, filmmaker, and horror enthusiast known for his work as the frontman of the metal band White Zombie, as well as his solo music career. Personally, I'm a huge fan. He's also made a significant impact in the film industry, directing cult horror films like House of a Thousand Corpses, The Devil's Rejects, and his reimagined Halloween franchise. His unique style blends horror, metal, and a dark aesthetic, making him a beloved figure in music and cinema. Sherry Moon Zombie, Rob's longtime partner in Muse, is an actress and fashion designer best known for her roles in her husband's films. With her striking looks and fierce on-screen presence, she's become an essential part of Rob Zombie's cinematic world, playing iconic characters like Baby Firefly and The Devil's Rejects and Three from Hell. Before we check out Rob Zombie's current residence, let's take a look at some of his former homes. His Hancock Park residence in LA was famously showcased on MTV Crips. The 7,000 square foot, half Tudor, half timber house built in 1924 had six bedrooms as well as cozy spaces like a wood paneled living room, pub rooms, and a formal entry. Zombie bought it in 1999 for $1.7 million and sold it in 2014 for $3.95 million. The home featured unique decorations like taxidermy, movie posters, and a polar bear from the Addams Family TV show. Other highlights included a remodeled kitchen, a home theater, gym, and even Rob's one-of-a-kind pirate bar, complete with Captain Hook memorabilia and skulls. Rob's former home also boasted a movie library full of VHS tapes and a master suite decorated like Disney's Haunted Mansion, complete with themed wallpaper. The property included a guest house, pool house, and a swimming pool. In 2014, Rob Zombie and his wife Sherry Moon Zombie listed their Woodbury, Connecticut home for sale at $2.3 million. The nearly 4,700 square foot colonial mansion, built in part in the mid 1700s, offered four bedrooms, four baths, and nine rooms in total. Inside, the couple's home boasted plank wood floors, exposed wood beams, multiple fireplaces, and a kitchen with a stone top center island. The living room featured four sets of French doors that opened to a covered patio, offering expansive views of the tree-shaded river. Next to the living area is a cozy library with original wainscoting, an exposed river rock fireplace, and built-in bookcases. The bedrooms had distinctive Amityville horror-style quarter circle windows, and there were also sun porches, a loft, as well as a separate guest house. Also upstairs, that rustic loft had a design that included a large bedroom with vaulted ceilings, wood beams, and more of those Amityville style windows to add an eerie yet elegant touch. A full staircase led up to a loft space and the suite includes a walk-in closet and dressing room. In the master bath, the shower and toilet are located in a private area while the freestanding soaking tub, flanked by matching sinks, is integrated into the bedroom for unique open concept design. The sprawling 23 acre property also had two barns, an in-ground swimming pool, a tennis court and landscaped gardens. The zombies purchased the Woodbury property located about 90 miles from Midtown Manhattan in late 2008 for $1.9 million. While they listed it those years back, the couple still owns and lives part time on a farm in Connecticut. So they might have actually kept this place. Rob and Sherry Moon Zombie moved to their current home in Laurel Canyon after selling their former LA house and purchasing this one for about $2.5 million. This property perfectly combines mid-century design with a spooky dark aesthetic. 
The property was built in 1953 by architect Robert Thorgerson and is tucked away in a remote section of the celeb-filled Laurel Canyon area in Hollywood. It features a distinctive folded roofline and walls of glass hidden from street view. The home has been updated with modern luxuries but still maintains a dark gothic vibe with the exterior even painted black. Inside, the zombie's house spans 2,236 square feet with two bedrooms and two baths on a sizable 15,000 square foot lot. It has 14 foot ceilings and plenty of natural light from the walls of glass. A dark cave-like area leads down to the front door, setting the mood for what's inside. There's a large living room, dining room overlooking the pool, a renovated kitchen, and a family room that opens up to an indoor-outdoor koi pond. The master bedroom has a dungeon-like atmosphere with 14-foot ceilings and windows that are placed too high to even gaze out of, as well as a fireplace and master bath with soaking tub. Elsewhere in the home, there's a second bedroom and a home office. Outside, you'll find landscape gardens, a pool with a wooden deck, and spacious flagstone terrace with plenty of room to lounge. In addition to the main home, the zombies expanded the property by purchasing the house next door in 2018. They reportedly spent more than $4.5 million on the neighboring property, creating a mini compound. The house, originally built in 1957, has undergone major renovations and now resembles a contemporary mini mansion. The two homes share one long private driveway with plenty of parking space. Altogether, the Zombies Hollywood Hills estate is estimated to have cost them over $7 million. While their primary residence is in Los Angeles, Rob and Sherry Moon also own a farm in Connecticut, which might just be the one they tried to list many years ago. Either way, their country home is filled with adopted animals like goats, cats, and a pug named Godzilla. Sherry, who also loves gardening, frequently shares her outdoor projects on social media. Both Sherry and Rob Zombie are passionate vegans and dedicated animal advocates. In 2019, they were honored with the Woodstock Warrior Award at the Woodstock Sanctuary's 14th Annual Thanksgiving Gala for their efforts against animal cruelty. Rob, in his acceptance speech, dedicated the award to a duck named Rob Zombie, who shares his name. In addition to their advocacy work, the couples teamed up with PETA, even rescuing two goats, Ginger and Claire, through the organization. After looking at the homes of Rob Zombie and Sherry Moon Zombie, we can see their personalities and lifestyle goes a lot deeper than their spooky last name. Aside from their dark-themed Los Angeles house, the two also share a farm in Connecticut where they can rescue animals and focus on their other passions. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you all in another house tour. Bye.